Okay, good morning. Ah, I'm sorry, I just got distracted. I saw my old motorbike instructor. That's cute. Sorry, I'm in junior lab right now, and this is probably not smart because I don't know about the whole if your phone's not in a locked position in the car, you can get done. And I am going past a police station. But I'm only doing this video because in my last one, I realized I didn't really give any background to me and my horse. And uh, so I'm gonna do that now. So um, Malibu, my horse, she is, I assume a 16, two, 16, three right now. She's pretty big. Um, she is a warm blood thoroughbred by Chicago. Um, sorry. And yep, she has just starting her competing career this year. She only just started jumping last November or December. I don't really remember which one it was. But uh, yeah, so she's going really well. She's only four. I don't know if I've said that yet. <laughs> I'm a bit distracted, but she's only four. And yeah, she's, she's just doing absolutely super. She's so smart and loving and I, I love her. She is basically my child. And her show name is Beggar's Delight Bahama Mama. And we've only done that because we think it's bloody hilarious when people try and pronounce it. But um, now on to me. I am 19, 20 in June. Just gonna add that in there. And I am an electrical apprentice who also rides horses. <laughs> and I have just gotten back into it. So like um, towards the end of last year, I just started riding again. I actually had four years off to start my apprenticeship and to start my work career and just to basically focus on that but yeah anyway I'm gonna leave it here because I'm pulling up to my TAFE and I don't want the people to see me <laughs> okay goodbye editing charm here um I did have other videos because I was going to go walk my cross-country course Friday afternoon but then it didn't end up being open and I really needed to pack my stuff and wash my horse and so I just, I did film but I've had to cut it because then it doesn't make sense and it's just a waste of time. So, that's it. It's a gorgeous cow. <laughs> I've just given her a bath. She broke the bloody tire bay and escaped. So I had to give her two baths. Hey. And now, this is actually pretty dry already, so flat her up. Oh, I don't think I've done that bad. Got a few down there. Hey, Missy, and you stood so quietly the whole time. Hell yeah. Hey, you sleeping? Good morning, properly. <laughs> Coffee's bubbling, sorry. It's currently. Oh, damn it, look, it's like spilling all over. I can't see, it's spilling over my hands. Sorry, right, it's currently like 6 in the morning. And I'm just gonna go put all my stuff in the car. And then I need to grab my belt from the other float. And then grab my horse, where. Oh, I don't even know where she is because she paddock walks, so. That's gonna be fun. So I got my belt from the goose neck. And as I'm leaving, I can now hear, I don't know if you're gonna hear it on the phone, but there is a, sh a lot of buzzing from bees. Obviously there's a bee hive in the tree above and I am definitely allergic. And I reckon they know it because then they'll just wanna hang around, test the boundaries, you know? Well don't, because I will swell up like a balloon. Malibu, what the hell? What have you done? How, how have you done that? <laughs> oh God, so silly.
and the water and I'm just going to go to the toilet and, and get my numbers and then start getting ready. So wish me luck. <laughs> Got my numbers and it comes with a cute little rider bag. That's so sweet. I love that. Oh, that is not good lighting. Um, <laughs> I am back home. I'm probably going to be leaving again in 30 minutes to go back to help my cousin because she is by herself. But so dressage, you know, had a few little, a few little ugly bits, but overall wasn't too bad. I was sitting in 13th on 36. Not too bad. Could be better, but not too bad. <laughs> Show jumping. Uh, like usual, she was a star, you know. All clear. Didn't even look at him. I guess now that's the easy part for her. So, you know, show jumping tomorrow. We'll see how that goes. But now I'm sitting in 12th, which I'm happy with. <laughs> um, she hasn't really put a foot wrong, so can't be more um, pleased with that. Also, uh, yeah, apparently I just forgot to film before I went. I mean, my show jumping did come up pretty fast. I think we went in early. So I literally went dressage, get ready again, show jumping. So, yeah, but so it's just going to be straight to it. Sorry about that.
so great. <laughs> Stop it. It's <laughs> you haven't even been yet. We're quite hot. Um, <laughs> not feeling the best today. Want some rain? Um, I'm gonna put the bridle on now. <laughs> Actually, putting on the bonnet. I'm putting put on the, the bonnet first. on. It's um, it's an equi-lined bonnet with diamonds on it. I bought it second hand. Because I can't afford that. <laughs> anyway, we're gonna put the bonnet on. <laughs> this is how you put a bonnet on the end of the shy horse. You're doing you great. Just, you just go slowly. You start with the um opposite ear when you can get to it. First of all, you give it a stroke. <laughs> so you can get there. <laughs> we just got it away. No, okay. <laughs> we'll just put the bridle down for five <laughs> while we work on this. Be back soon. <laughs> Can you pass the bridle? We've got the bridle. We've got the bridle on. Yeah. We are about to <laughs> address the bridle situation and put this on here. We're just going to trust that my horse won't run away. Hopefully. <laughs> See him running off with half a bonnet on. <laughs> no. See ya. <laughs> Come here. At least I'll have it on video. Yeah. It's, it's quite steamy today. Yes. I'm really feeling under pressure that you got the camera on, man. I feel like I don't even know how to put it on. <laughs> do you want me to do it step by step? All good. Put the reins over the head. Yeah. This is how Charm packs her gear. Get the brush. <laughs> and we brush the horse. <laughs> And we get the saddle pad and we place it on the back. Yep. Bit in the mouth. We're getting somewhere, ladies and gents. First ear in. Fending ear. Second ear. Fucking Yay! Smooth ass. Well done! <laughs> Ew, why was Sam just filming like this? Good morning. <laughs> I'm just getting ready and we're going early. I hit bees again. Oh my god. Oh, I'm not getting bit. Not stung, whatever it is. But anyway, we're leaving early because I'm going to go watch my cousin who's on at 8.15. I am not on till 3 pm today. So, I've got a long way ahead of me, but we'll go watch her, and then we'll help her, and then do a jumping, and then watch some of the three star, four stars, and then I'll come back and get more. Just gonna add it for the vlog. <laughs> you did that last time. <laughs> Ready to go. Yay! <laughs>
So Oz Charm has had success with her young horse, Vegas Delight Barmarama. And she's continued on. Now. Unfortunately, Malibu and I didn't make it around, but you know, she wasn't doing anything naughty. It was like 20% new jumps. It's only, it's only a second time ever eventing. And it was about 80% the atmosphere. There's lots of people sitting around, cars everywhere, big scary four star jumps she's got to look at. And it was just too much for her today. At 3 p.m. in the afternoon, she's kind of shut off. So, unfortunately, I guess I'll just wait till the next turn to see how we go. But definitely, I always say you're disappointed, obviously, but I'm not mad at her. No, she's only a baby and she'll learn. So, it just gives me stuff to work on with her. I'm not catching you. <laughs> well, I guess that is a wrap for vlog number two. And I guess I'll just have to do my training and we'll see how we go at Warrilu because that will be my next one. But I guess that's just how <laughs> it is if you, you ride horses. You win some and you lose some. But I don't really count this as a loss. I just count it as a, a learning curve and... Now this little journey. <laughs> She's enjoying her food now because it is time for dinner. So I guess I'll see you next time. <laughs>